Hi guys, in this video I will tell you about the Dutch East India Company and how they arrived in India and how they traded in India and what were the factors for their decline. So the Dutch, the United East India Company of the Netherlands was formed United East India Company of the Netherlands was formed in March 1602 by the Charter of Dutch Parliament and had the powers to wage wars, make treaty and build forts. So it was formed by the Charter of Dutch Parliament and it had the power to wage wars, make treaty and build forts. So they were free to wage wars, acquire territory, make treaty and build forts. So the Dutch factories in India, Dutch arrived in the Masuli Patnam in Odisha and present day Odisha and they established factories there. First factory was in Masuli Patnam 1605. Then it was in Pulikat 1610, then Surat 1616, then Bimli Patnam 1641, Karikal 1645, Chinsura 1653, Kasim Bazar, ba Barangor, Patna, Balasor, Nag Patnam in 1658. They established Kasim Bazar, Barangor, Patna, Balasor, Nag Patnam in 1658 and then Cochin in 1663 so they established so many factories here and they traded from these factories and also they fortified their factories to protect them from enemies so I will repeat again Masuli Patnam in 1605 Pulikat in 1610 Surat in 1616 Bhimli Patnam in 1641 Karikal in 1645 Chinsura in 1653 Kasim Bazar, Barangor, Patna, Balasor, Nag Patnam in 1658 and Cochin in 1663. The cause of their decline was that the defeat of the Dutch in the Anglo-Dutch rivalry and the shifting of Dutch attention towards the Malay archipelago. archipelago. That is, the, uh, there was an Anglo-Dutch rivalry which was a very intense rivalry which was going on between the East India Company, British East India Company and the Dutch United East India Company so to trade in the Indian subcontinent. So the Dutch and, and the, so they, they were defeated in this rivalry. Dutch were defeated and they focused their attention towards the Malay archipelago. The British agreed to never interfere in the trade of the Malay archipelago and the Dutch, Dutch, uh, Dutch, uh, Dutch told the British that they will never interfere in the trade of the Indian subcontinent. So how did the Dutch Empire decline that uh, they seized three English ships which are which were in the Bay of Bengal. Dutch seized three English ships. Uh, the, the communication between the three ships as they left from Kolkata for uh, Kolkata to Mumbai. So the communication was cut between Bay of Bengal and Arabian Sea. So the Dutch th seized three English ships but in Bay of Bengal but uh, English English were not able to accept this and they sent their armies and there was a battle which was fought in the uh, battle of Bidara, Bidara which was which is near Chinsura and in 1759 the Dutch were defeated so you can see their battle of Bidara is being fought and the Dutch Dutch people are being killed and the British won here so they now the Dutch fleet uh, this is battle of Bidara as you can see here not very clear picture but uh, very informative in the battle of Bitara 1759 the Dutch were defeated and then they left for their Malay archipelago that is this fleet of Dutch is le leaving for Malay archipelago so they were they are going for Malay archipelago and uh, okay guys then see you in the next video these were the uh, this this was about the Dutch United East India Company, their formation, their uh, trading uh, posts and factories in India, and their decline.